Welcome back. The Batam Concession Agency, or BP Batam, celebrated its 51st anniversary last Wednesday, October 26, at Balai Sari BP Batam in Batam, Indonesia's Riau Islands. The celebration of the 51st BP Batam anniversary was marked by cutting of the Indonesian cone-shaped rice dish, or commonly known as nasi tumpeng or birthday cake, by the head of BP Batam, Muhammad Rudi, and was celebrated with joy by all BP Batam employees. This year's celebration was special, as it was also attended by three previous heads of BP Batam, namely Ismet Abdullah, Mustafa Wijaya and Hatanto Rexo Diputro. Also the CEO of Lion Group, Rusdi Kirana, and the pioneer of modern schools in Batam, Sri Sudarsono, were also present on the anniversary. Muhammad Rudi, in his direction, gave his appreciation to all his employees, who had served the nation and the state. He mentioned that BP Batam has achieved various achievements as a public body institution. Therefore, he invites all attendees to interpret the momentum of the 51st anniversary of BP Batam with gratitude, as well as to improve themselves to be better individuals. Furthermore, the BP Batam anniversary was also marked with a number of awards and entertainment performances, namely as follows, the first being the submission of the ISO 9001-2015 Quality Management System Certification. The second being the signing of the cooperation between BP Batam, PT Batam International Airport, and PT Batam Engineering regarding the technical use of Hang Nadim Airport assets in the Special Economic Zone. The third being the single data launching button press. The fourth being the distribution of compensation for orphans of the BP Batam employees. And the last being the Pratharya Sonata's performance. The head of BP Batam Promotion and Protocol Public Relations Bureau who is also the chairman of the BP Batam Anniversary Committee, Arya Stuti Sirait, specifically conveyed the submission of the ISO certification as a form of his party's commitment to improving services to the community at this mature age. The ISO 9001-2015 certification was given to three work units. The first was the Bureau of Public Relations Promotion and Protocol for Public Services, Compliant Management and Documentation. The second was the General Bureau for Archival Services, and the third was for the Directorate of Land Management for Land Management Services. In the future, BP Batam will focus on improving infrastructure sectors and accelerating economic growth to attract more local and international investors.